kid back quote s camp so i got a job as a waitress in a restaurant i worked there for a short time for which there are reasons this restaurant is located at the recreation center there used to be a children's camp in this camp a girl somehow died and apparently it all started with that or maybe not with that stories of herd cleaners we don't go to building three alone we always take security with us building three is where this girl died something terrible happens there steps doors open by themselves and also we heard that red water was flowing from the tap but we don't know we didn't find it previously all the personnel from the base lived in this building so we constantly heard in the corridor that someone was walking in heels and knocking on the door someone no one opened it they're afraid oh yes the third building was on fire more than once on its own well they say so chef why are you afraid of her well she walks around the kitchen she doesn't do anything bad to anyone i'm already used to her in the morning you come to the kitchen she's sitting here in white well she'll sit and disappear only rattles with pots drop plates from the cupboard once the girl is playing assistant cook yes i saw her or not her we come early for breakfast in the morning at six o'clock i come as usual open the hall and something is in the way i look there is a saucepan on the floor i got scared took it and put her on the distribution and she walks around the hall it's dark in the hall i decided to turn on the light so that she would leave i turned it on i looked out the window at the door and the pan was standing there again quote bartender i didn't see but i heard i'm the last one to leave the restaurant i close all the doors and i have to turn off all the lights to go out and close the door with a key and every time there are rustles steps it's terrible terribly scary well now actually what i myself saw there is a canister of water on the floor in the kitchen the other waitresses and i often observed that she was moving as if someone was lightly kicking her from the other side well the sounds are appropriate at night my colleague and i were afraid to sleep in the dark and we left the light on in the morning the light was off but the water was on once we sat up with the girls and went out for a smoke i clearly saw someone sitting in the gazebo night winter the lights were turned off everywhere no services were already working and someone was sitting there i showed this to the girls we decided to come up but when we went into the room for jackets and left there was no one else the hall caught fire in the restaurant at night by itself and went out in the same way nothing burned except the walls also often from over voltage or for some other reason the light blinked there was another such case the cook and i go into a restaurant together she immediately went to the kitchen and i went to the locker room i hear screams and screams i run up and the cook shouts to me liza i saw her she was sitting here and points me to a chair well like the last one all the staff were in the kitchen they were discussing something and at the sink ladles spoons forks begin to rattle knock there were seven of us everyone heard thank you for your attention subscribe to the channel